We've spent the last five days running around in this cold, unforgiving wilderness. Well, I guess technically this is a cold, unforgiving city. And essentially wasted our time in Dishong Tower. I mean, not entirely. Got some experience out of it. Probably got some skill points to spend. I don't know. I think we got a level. I'm not sure. Got some loot. None of it great, though. And I thought, well, we're just going to live with it because I don't have the time to record again. And having done that quest three times now, and it failed all three times, I remain unconvinced that I'm going to get a different result. I'm pretty sure it's going to be the exact same. Uh, that is ever so technically better. I guess we'll take that and we'll see if we use it. I, I don't know. Whatever. It's, it's fine. Those are going to be no good. T-shirt's not going to be helpful here. I figure since we're out in the cold, it might not be a bad idea to see if maybe we can find a, a nice puffer coat or something. Oh, wow. Lots of choices here. That one's quite a bit better than the other one we found, right? So here, we'll put that one back. Okay. It's no bueno. That's definitely better, but also definitely worse. Okay. I don't want to spend all day going through clothing, so I'm just going to be fine with that. We'll, we'll switch them out a little later on here. We're inside, so it's it's warm enough for now. Um, there. There we go. That's fine. Back to the tack rifle we found. Now, we did find this in Higashi. Nope. Deshong. So, it wasn't like Deshong was a total waste of time. Quality 6 tack rifle. Not bad. I got no complaints about that. I mean, damage-wise, I have no idea how it rates compared to other tack rifles. Pretty sure we already have one, but not a quality... Or quality 6, rather. Did I say quality 5? Quality 6. Oh, um... I want to say that was intentional, and you're very clever. I don't appreciate that. But, you know, throw some mods on it. It certainly seems sufficient. There's a lot of S sounds right there. That's definitely warmer. I said it was done, but apparently I needed to check a couple more just for the giggles. All right. Nothing there either. Madam. Ooh, there's a cat outside. Oh, we got a businessman inside. Just go ahead and give you the old run and stab. How you doing, sir? Okay. Um, my goodness, where are all these dudes coming from? Is there a wandering horde passing through? Kind of feels like it for as many guys as there are. Oh, wow. I'm going to say that you're Neo and you dodged that. Good on you, sir. Good on you. Okay, what do you have? What you got? Um, oh, whatever. Take all the things. It doesn't matter. Let's check the loot we came in here for, because this is really the only reason we came in. Uh, that's not bad right there. Uh, sure, take all those things. I don't think we need a small or tool tank whatever mod, but uh, we'll take them anyway. Adam. Nice try, Neo. Nice try. I think I took a knee to the arrow. And I know exactly what I said. Okay. Let's get rid of these guys in here. You know what? I'm done with them. I'm done with zombies today. I've had enough of your shenanigans. You guys just need to be put down. Enough shenanigans for one day. Right, little drone? It is getting pretty close to evening here, so, you know. Trying to be mindful of that. Let's just get in and out. I mean, what's game stage at? 108. I think it was at 105 the last time we looked, so it has gone up a little bit. And this area, too. I'm pretty sure the, the snowy area is the second most difficult, if I'm remembering that right. 
I mean, it's not going to be much of a change because quality three and quality four are basically the same thing, but hey, it's ever so slightly better. And then we did take some clothing, did we not? Here, let's modify you. Take that off of that, modify you, put that on that, complete that, and wear that, and then bye-bye goth pants. We don't need those anymore. And then I think we're ever so slightly warmer. Excellent. So I'm going to go ahead and use one of these guys since we have this hardened chest right here, and this will let us get right through without any problems. In terms of what else we're going to be doing while out here, wow, this was maybe better than the loot at the other one? I don't know, that quality 5 club, that is not anything to sneeze at. It's really not. Ah, uh, sure, we'll take that guy. Ma'am. Incoming enemies, prepare for conflict. Don't care about that, that's fine. Uh, I don't think there's anything on the roof that we care about. I think at this point we're basically done. And we can go across the street to the Cracker Cafe. Which, you say that the wrong way, and that almost sounds like a bad, bad thing. But here, let's go to the Cracker Book. And I don't think we have... Oh man, we have a lot of stuff in the truck. I, I kind of loaded it up with everything, just by the by. Here, I've been keeping hold of that one just because we don't need to put that in there. Look at this. Look at all these mods and things in there. Well, filled it up with clubs and stuff. Clubs. I guess we can drop that guy, because that's just not worth it. That's hunt garbage. That's not worth it. That's not worth it. Um, 528 parts. That's not bad. 99. That's not worth it. I don't think we need bow or crossbow parts. Those don't do any good for us anymore. Not since I changed how some things work, and then we don't really need the rocket launcher part. We'll find a rocket launcher. I mean, it'll be fine. In terms of if we really want one, we'll just find one. We don't need to make one. Doesn't look like there are going to be a lot of things to loot in here. Unfortunately. I don't think I've seen this particular POI, though, so... Kind of curious to see just in general what this one looks like. I was hoping that we would find a trader while we're out here. I assume there is one and that we just haven't driven by him. I kind of keep trying to look at the map every so often just to see if I see the little trader face on the map. I haven't noticed it yet. Doesn't mean that it hasn't been around. It just means I haven't noticed it. That's all. So that one's on me. If I haven't noticed, my apologies. But it would be nice to find another trader, especially because we have a bunch of stuff to sell. And I don't know that we really need the money per se. But if we're not going to get it, well then what's the point of taking all this loot? Hey, look at that. There's the tuna fish gravy toast recipe I was just talking about yesterday. Hooray, we have found it now. Maybe I have seen this one. It's just... Oh no, I think I know this one. Never mind. There's just something about it that looked different to me. I guess the outside of it. Pretty sure we've been in this one before, so it's really just, you know, coming in here at this point now to see if there are any new recipes or schematics we can find, because, you know, helpful. Very helpful. Okay, and we'll take all those things there. Reload that for the one round that we used, because I think that's all it was. Hoping for better stuff back here, but come on, man. Uh, that's actually kind of useful. Not great, but it is useful. Uh, nope. That one. I don't know why, but I've just gone very gun-heavy this week. I think it's really just because I'm trying to run through that stupid POI three times. I just got to the point where I was tired, and guns are still the uh, fastest, most efficient way to get through anything. I mean, don't get me wrong. I enjoy using the bow. I mean, clearly I do. 
and I even like using the spear now. But, nah. Master, we are not alone. I just, sometimes you just want to get through stuff as quickly as possible. Let's see, we still have five minutes on lockpicking. Let's see if we can get through this guy before he breaks through the door. It might be iffy. Uh, if he's going to stand there running, well, stand and run, whatever. Then we got no problem here. Oh, look at that. He has a friend on his shoulders. Uh, take all the things for now. It's fine. Is everyone dead? I think everyone's... No. Nope. Adam. Can I check this box, please? Well, there's the recipe for the... The thingy-majigger, but apparently we already had that one. Sir, I'm busy. I'm looking for reading material that we don't already have. So far, not really finding any. Maybe not as much. Come on, repair kits. Nope. Was hoping for a repair kit. Well, there's the military armor schematic. I think I talked about that one yesterday as well. Or if not yesterday, the day before, because... One of the previous runs through Dishong found that. Now we have it for reelsy reels. That's exciting. Let's get out of here. Oh, wow, it is super cold. I'm going to go ahead and use a coffee then. That'll give us warmth for about three minutes. It's not going to be very long. It's probably going to be insufficient. But it's something It's better than nothing. I mean, really... The smart thing to do would have been to take, I don't know, one of those hoodies or sweaters or something from Savage Country and and really just use that to, to pump up cold resistance. I think one of the other times I also found uh, one of the mods that you put on armor or clothing for cold resistance, the insulated mod. Eh. No such luck this time around, and boy, was that handy. Just gonna try and fill in a little bit more of the map, although. Come on. Looks like maybe we have at this point. It's kind of a shame. Alright. We got a building right here. We can continue going around this then. I'm not really paying super close attention to what these buildings are, just. I'm trying to tell if any of them are traitors. That's the main thing. It's not as foggy over here, so this is kind of nice. can actually see where we're going a bit. I suppose I can turn on the headlights and that would help. I've learned that. I'm going to stop right quick just because... I don't know if that hit you. It doesn't really matter if it did or didn't. This isn't why I'm stopping, by the way. We really don't need to harvest another wolf with a spear. I mean, we just can. There you go. Take an extra 30% on that one. I just wanted to stop right here. Money. Uh, medical supplies. Okay. Yep, no honey out of that one. That's fine. I don't know that we have the book for that anyway. I don't remember. It's really just kind of the thought, honey, oh yeah, we don't have anything to help us against infection if we get infected. I mean, we've got a ton of crap back at the base, but... I mean, base, just so you know, is way the crap over there. I mean, it's technically labeled as storage, not, not base. But it's a long drive from here. So it's not terribly convenient if we end up getting infected. And I just thought, well, if we do, then we can have something to deal with it. I'm not mistaken. We should be able to make the rest of those guys. And then here, let's... I'm just going to deal with it, whatever. Drop off all the stuff in there, because all the money and things are going to go in there. It's going to be annoying. Oh, all right. I wanted to get the gasoline out of that, but I guess we're not going to, huh? 
Let's go to the southern extent of this town and see if there's anything over here. Excuse me. Come through. Gotta watch out for those trucks, man. They don't stop. This is a pretty good size area, though, when you look at it overall. It's pretty large. I don't know if it's the largest area we have found thus far, but it's definitely good size. Okay, then. That, that was the thing that happened right there. That sure was. We're right on the edge of the, the wasteland, too. Which, it, I do kind of wonder, and it's on my to-do list, how in the world are we supposed to get over here? Like, what's the actual road? So, by the time we're ready to go back to base, one of my plans is to just take the road back, figure that out. Because there has to be a road that comes out here. As far as I know, it's programmed to be that way. We're going to stop right here just for our last stomp of the day, I think. And we'll just see if we can find anything of value over here. Actually, let's check these guys, too. Dynamite. Well, it looks like these shelves have been picked clean. Holy moly, man. I mean, it's just a little extra experience. That's the only reason I'm reading them. It's really not any rhyme or reason. Ooh. Tempered Blade Schematic. Okay. Well, that's cool, because we didn't already have one of those. We didn't have that knowledge, I guess I should say more correctly. Don't need the goth pants, that's fine. Just out of curiosity... It is over here. Okay, it's just the next door. I didn't pay attention to what the next one is. Oh, it's mailboxes. Okay, so it's an apartment building. Oh, the whole thing is considered it. A block. That's interesting. Hey, buddy. I saw you down there. I saw you, I did. Uh, I'm not even going to worry about scrapping those. I'm just not feeling it right now. So I don't think there's really a whole lot for this POI. Alright, well, if that's the case, let's just keep going a little longer. I thought maybe there'd be a little more, but it looks like it's just apartment buildings on top. That's fine. I'd still like to fill in some more of this map, because I really am convinced that there's a traitor out here. It's just a matter of finding him or her them. There you go. How about that? I really don't want to go this way. I was trying to go this way, so we'll, we'll go this way. Ooh, donuts don't sound bad right now. Hmm. I don't know what this one is. I can't read the sign. The Coleman Drive-In. No. Is that... Coleman's driving. Yeah, okay. There's the traitor. I knew there had to be one over here somewhere. So what I did is I just kind of left that last place and started driving around. I found the main road, which it looks like maybe this place connects by way of going up to the north. And there's a main road that goes that way. It's the one right there. But... I'm not sure how this connects to the rest of the world, like to the rest of the map, so... That is kind of interesting. I'm not sure what to make of that. We'll go ahead and mark Trader Wrecked on the map, which I'm really sad that it's Trader Wrecked, because... That's all we have on this map is Trader Wrecked. I think there's like one Trader Bob, maybe. Maybe a Trader Hugh? I don't even remember. But it's basically Trader Wrecked as far as the eye can see, which... Again disappointing. But I want to go hit the road over here. Let's see how it just turns. 
<laughs> uh, it's just it turns right there. Oh, that's that is interesting. That is very interesting. But it connects over here with. It looks like it's going to go to another area. So I think what I'll do is I'll just uh, head that way for now. We'll fill in a little more of the map and we will catch up on the next one as we are journeying through the wasteland and maybe eventually possibly arriving somewhere that is different or not. I don't know. Whatever. Catch you next one. Tell them thanks for watching. See you later.